up all phrases. To Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai. Double honesty, Apostle Great Millstone, and citate to you brothers pushing the word and truth and the sincerity, all right? I just wanted to get into a quick lesson, basically about prayer, you know? Because the weapons of our warfare is not carnal. And we must remember to pray, especially being these evil times, man. The times we in, okay? So I'm gonna get straight to it. In 2 Corinthians chapter 10, verse 4, it say, For the weapons of our warfare are not carnal, but mighty through the most high to the pulling down of strongholds, man. And that's how we're gonna uh, overcome this devil, man. You know? That's how the elect is gonna overcome the devil, man. Through what? Through the word of Yahweh Bashim was shot. I believe it's another scripture, Revelations uh, 12 and 11, all right? Through the testimony of the Lamb, Yahweh Shai, and through the word, man. That's how we're gonna break these strongholds, these philosophies, these lies, the falsehoods, you know? And ultimately, the uh, the enemy, man, you know? Through, through the word and prayer of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai, all right? This uh, 1 Thessalonians chapter 5, verse 17. It says, pray without ceasing. We got to remember to pray always, man. You know? Pray always, man, without ceasing. All right? Like Apostle Rakai, you know, the uh, the spirit was on him heavy. So always be on prayer, man. You know, if you need to send a prayer up in your car, you know, you could do so. Wherever you at, man. You know, it don't have to always be like, you know, the ritual or... Uh, Getting on your knees and facing the east. Hey, sometimes, man, you, if you need to be in this, if the spirit is on you to pray, you have to pray, man, because you got to remember who your power is, all right? And um, verse 18, 1 Thessalonians 5 and 18, it say, In everything give thanks, for this is the will of the Most High in Yahweh Shai HaMashiach concerning you, all right? And that scripture remind me of Proverbs 3 and 6, all right? Uh, in all thy ways, acknowledge him, and he shall direct thy paths. All right? So in everything you do, you know, you got to acknowledge your how about Shem was shy, and the Lord is going to protect you and guide you, man. You know, like King David, he all, whatever he, before he did something, he always got counsel, man, because he knew who his power was, man. You know? And likewise today, the scriptures say things written aforetime is written for our learning. So we must take the examples of those great men that came before us, man. All right? All the men of the Lord prayed to Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah before they did anything, man. Especially going to war, you know? So how much more we live in the, um, the end times now? Because this is the end. So we must remember to pray. And pray always without ceasing, man. You know? This is uh, Psalm 144 and 1. It said, Blessed be the Lord, Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai, my strength, was teaching my hands to war and my fingers to fight. All right? Because, hey, like the first scripture I read, the weapons of warfare is not carnal, man. You know, through Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai, we're going to take down these strongholds, man. We're going to we're gonna break the lies and the falsehoods, man. Through Yahweh, through the spirit and power of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai, man. The scripture tells you that vengeance belongs unto the Lord, man. You know, uh, this is Psalm 94, 23. But the Lord, Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai, is my defense and my power is the rock of my refuge, man. And that's our stronghold, man. Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai is our stronghold, man. So we must remember to always turn to our power, man, for all things, you know. For all things, ask Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai, man. That's why the scripture in Isaiah 30 and 1, it say, Woe them to go down to Egypt, man, and strengthen, them, and strengthen themselves in, the, uh, uh, in Pharaoh, man. You know? Hey, before we do anything, man, you know, we got to pray to you. How about Shimei I was and ask the Lord to guide us and strengthen us, you know, for whatever we need, man. And the Lord going to direct us, and, and, and if that's his will, it's going to happen for you, man. And to protect us as we walk through the, the valley of the shadow of death. You know, because we live in the real evil times, man. So we must remember to pray without ceasing, man. Because the weapons of our warfare is not carnal. You know, we're not going to do anything, man. We're going to preach this word. We're going to fight for the, uh, the truth. You know, and constantly endure, man. 
you know, and pray the Lord keep the spirit upon us and pray the Lord give us strength to make it, man. You know, but that's just a quick scripture of the day. You know, uh, the web is our warfare and our condo, so we must remember to pray without ceasing, you know. So hopefully this lesson was edifying, and with that, Shalom.